I'm going to get started. You know. When you go to work, do you work right away? And I had to bring my jacket on stage because I know white people steal, so. <laughs> yeah, you can laugh. I'm funny. It's okay. You can laugh. I'm funny. It's all right. 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 We look good up in here. My goodness. Yes, fine. Lovely women. You look good. I swear I could follow you home and kill you. You look good, man. <laughs> You gotta kill her. You gotta kill her. You can't just follow her and walk away. You know, you gotta. She will feel insulted. You know what I'm saying? You gotta. You get what I'm saying? You gotta, you know, it's so good. <laughs> yes, I love this. I love this. Man, you look good. I swear you do. Oh, man. Are you allergic to electric tape? Never mind. We talk about it. Later. Just, just want to know it. <laughs> Just want to get all this in the air right now. I swear, you are fine. Man, you could call me Nick and I wouldn't get mad. You hear me? <laughs> I swear. That. <laughs> that's, that's right up here, right there. Oh, oh you'll call me nigga? You'll call me nigga. You give me a call, you'll call me nigga. <laughs> Racist. <laughs> oh. Girl was over my house the other night. She said, I'll stay tonight, but we're not going to have sex. I said, okay, I'll take you to a restaurant and you ain't going to eat. <laughs> it's fair, it's fair. <laughs> On the flight over here, now we all flown planes before. Now, what they have is this thing where you lay your seat back in a stewardess. Has this ever happened to you where she go, excuse me, you have to bring your seat in an upright position or the plane can't take off? <laughs> so you telling me it ain't going to move unless I do this. <laughs> now, I'm no engineer, but I know <laughs> that it don't need me to do this for the plane to take off. Now, this is the part that I hate because you try to get there and try to get your sleep on real quick, comfortable, relax. She'll wake you up and go, excuse me, can you put your seat in the upright position or the plane can take off? I say, okay. Now, they can wake you up for that shit, but they won't wake you up when the food comes. <laughs> She's sleeping. I don't smoke weed no more. I got fucked up. Not high, fucked up. I was so fucked up, I was sitting on the TV watching the couch. You smoke weed, don't you? You smoke weed, you know. Well, my weed smokers laughing at that one, they know. Hello, I'm a type of comedian. I talk about the stuff that you talk behind closed doors. You know, that's how I am. I'm not, you know, I'm not filtered. I just, boom, bam, you can't filter me. I say what I feel, you know. And I love traveling to countries because we all fucked up, aren't we? Aren't we all? Everybody, every race is fucked up, you know. And I love certain places. I've been to so many places, man. And I always wanted to go to India. Couldn't afford it, so I just went to Leicester. <laughs> cheap, cheap. You know I ain't lying. You know I ain't lying. As soon as I came off that coach bus, no more, no. I was like, the coach goes far. I mean, yeah, yeah. That is the new India. I'm telling you now. Love it, love it, love it, love it, man. People say stupid shit sometimes. I think we should be allowed to kill four people a year. Just four people a year. Get a little card, stamp it, and you all right. Just stamp your four and start next year. You agree, you agree, you're laughing real hard. You understand what I'm saying? Because I'm on the plane 
Now, I'm on a plane. Long flight. I get up. I go to the bathroom. I come back. My paper's gone. I want to read my shit. So I'm wondering, where the hell my paper go? I look over. Man's reading my stuff. I'm like, sir, that's my paper. He looks at me and goes, oh, I thought you left. That's, that's, that's my first kill right there. First kill. I'm in the bank, minding my business. In the line, we all facing that way. Woman comes behind me. I taps him on the shoulders. Yes? Is this the back of the line? No, we standing backwards, bitch. What the fuck you think you said? See? That's my number two person. That's my number two. So, anybody got children here? Kids are allowed to do anything, aren't they? Little, little ones allowed to do anything and get away with it, sir. I'm in the toy store with my daughter. Now, it's time to leave. We leave the toy store, baby. Leave it. My daughter got the teddy bear in her hand. I'm like, whoa, whoa, baby. You just walk out with that? <laughs> <laughs> so we walk back in. I go, here's a teddy bear. My daughter walked out with it. She said, oh, she's so lovely. Oh, really? <laughs> so I, we left and went to the jewelry store. I'm like, shit. <laughs> Got to strike while the iron's hot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Go over there and look at those Rolex for daddy, baby. Go on. <laughs> the power of children. With the baby's mama and the baby's mama, she says, come in here and take a bath. Daughter got up and said, no, and walked off. I looked at my daughter and said, hey, 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 how did you do that? <laughs> People read into stuff too much. Do you agree? Yes. Now, I'm out with this lady. And I'm thinking we're going to have a race. Cool. Understand. Now, we're on the underground right there. Get off. Now, doors open. She gets out before me. She's a few feet in front of me. Now, she makes a right. I get out. I make a right. Now, I'm in a rush, so I walk fast. So, now, she looks back. She's me. Now, she walks fast. <laughs> so, I said, oh, a race. So I'm walking fast, she walking fast. Now I see where she's confused for the next thing that comes out of my mouth. I go, I'm gonna get you, you know. <laughs> you know. So now so she starts to run. And so I start to run. And she's hollering, rape, rape. So I'm running faster, saying, Oh my gosh, somebody trying to rape us. <laughs> I like to advertise for the big girl because now I see commercials that now I'm putting big women on television. I like that. I like that. Four figure women. I like women. I like women that got meat on their body. They got these skinny girls. I don't like them too skinny. I don't like them too skinny. I dated one girl. She was so skinny. If she was kidnapped, no ropes can hold her. No, she came over to my house. My cat thought I brought him a scratching pole. She was so skinny, she shook out her clothes. <laughs> I like a woman that got some, I'm, I'm a legs and butt man. Are you a legs and butt man? You like legs and butt on a woman? Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm like. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> I don't like a lot of ass, though. I don't like a lot of ass. You know when you got too much ass when she sit on your face and you don't hear the music no more? <laughs> so, are you okay down there? <laughs> you can't what? I'm boom, boom. I like a big girl. Don't lie about your size, though. I like a fat girl. Call the way it is. No, not call them fat. Let's call them hard to kidnap. <laughs> you ain't never heard no man take no big girl in by himself.
I like a big girl. Just don't lie about your size. Be who you are. That's what I say. You know? I like a woman that's natural. I don't like a woman with all that makeup on the face. It's kind of insulting you tell a woman, oh, you're pretty. Well, but you ain't see her yet. <laughs> you saw the face she put on. Because I dated a girl that had a lot of makeup. Went home, woke up the next morning, I called the police on her. I thought she broke in my house. You ladies, if you ain't no makeup artist, leave your eyebrows alone. That scouse brow, stop it. You're going to walk around surprised all day. How you look like this? Ain't nobody going to know what you're saying. You surprised. You can't tell her nothing exciting or surprising. I heard you was in a hospital. I was. <laughs> oh, the day's your birthday. It is. <laughs> Just be who you are to me. That's all I ask. I don't ask for your riches. I don't ask for all that. Just be natural. That's all. That's all I want, you know. Women lying about their size. Oh, I'm not fat. I'm just big bones. Dinosaurs got big bones. <laughs> no, my, my body just holds a lot of water. It holds cakes and pies. <laughs> Stop lying. Stop lying. Now, you don't know me. The doctor said I got slow metabolism. It runs in my family. Nobody runs in your family. That's the problem. <laughs> You ain't never did this in your life. I'm on my motorcycle with my big girl, showing her off, proud. And all I hear So I think, oh, we got a flat tire. No, tire's good, tire's good. We get back on the bike. I look in the mirror, it's her arms just swinging in the air. And you go, <laughs> like, throw your arms in so we can go faster. <laughs> Don't lie about your size. All that girdle stuff, leave that girdle stuff alone. That fucking your head up. It makes us thinking we're getting something good at night. I take one girl home, nice waist and everything. Man, look good. Hour shake glass. Now, I don't know about maybe a, a one hour, two hour. I don't know, but it was an hour shake. Nice full figure. <laughs> So we get home and I take unstrap that bra. And just she went straight from slim to job of the hut. <laughs> I was like, yo, the, the force is not here today. Man. That's too strong. I cannot lift it. I like role playing. I like role playing. Role playing is good. You ever role play in a bed? Is this your woman here? That's your woman. Do you name your dick? <laughs> Every man names their dick. You named your dick. Yes, you did. I call mine the truth. Because <laughs> evidently the truth hurts. <laughs> Some women can't handle the truth. But the truth will set you free, though, I'll tell you that. I role play in a bit. I like role playing. Star Wars is my favorite one. I like Star Wars. I was with this white girl. She was never with a black guy, so the first time I had to bring her to the dark side. <laughs> so I walked in there. <laughs> you will join me. <laughs> the force is powerful on this end. <laughs> I'll teach you all you need to know. If you refuse, then ah, oh, you have a sister. <laughs> Prepare yourself. father now.
this is a, a guest spot that he wanted me to come up and do, so hopefully he can book me in the club some more. Hope y'all can see me again. Um, y'all have been an absolutely... <laughs> Y'all, but I do not, I do, I do want to thank the club for bringing me up, giving me a chance, you know, I mean, I've been doing it 27 years, done television and all, but I like the grind, I love the comedy, you know what I'm saying, so I like that, so I don't mind doing these things, because it's sacrificing, they'll come out to something better, and hope he brings me up some more, and y'all can follow me on, Inst- um, I'm on Instagram, that's comedian, Will E, W-I-L-L-E, so when he do bring me back up, I'll post it up, and y'all can come see me, and my number is 078, but... <laughs> No, but y'all take care. I'm a- No, 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 no. This, this was a free show, so that means <laughs> you, ain't, you ain't getting no more shit, so. <laughs> I'm coming all. He gave me the light. I'm getting the fuck off. So, that, <laughs> so but no, nah, but Jimmy O, we done shows together. That's my man. So, you know, I know y- y'all be good, though, man. Y'all been drinking, so just be good going home. You know, be responsible. Don't drink and drive. You know, just pull over, take a sip, then get back on the road. <laughs> uh, uh, um, Will E, I'm out. Y'all take care.